What is up guys? Today I'm doing a very different video to normal. It's kind of like the glitch video I did a few days ago, um, because that was kind of out of the ordinary. This one is also, and it's about a cool thing in Bloon's TD6. Um, it's actually, the balloon right next to the red balloon, in sandbox mode, is invisible. Like, it's got this white border, and then it's just got the blue behind it. So I'm going to call it an invisible balloon for the remainder of this video, because uh, I think that name suits it well. And basically, this defense we have here will not be able to pop it. We have a mage, we have super monkeys, snipers, cannons, glue, the, the fire uh, special guy, uh, what's he called? Gwendolyn, I think? Or she, I don't know what the name is. Yeah, Gwendolyn. We've got subs, tank sheets, we've got everything. But nothing here will be able to pop it. And I, in fact, I've only seen one thing that can pop this balloon. Only one thing I've found so far. And I've been testing it for quite a while. So if we, um, if we just speed this up, you'll see that the defense I have right now will easily be able to take out a BAD or a BAD. And that is the, that is the most fearsome balloon in the game. I haven't fortified it because it, this, it, that would just take too long to take down, but we could take it down pretty easily. Um, but you'll see that we just demolished those DDTs, demolished that BAD. Yet, when we send one of these invisible balloons, nothing seemingly can destroy it. You'll see that the fire and the glue has made it much more visible on the video and it looks really awesome, but nothing, absolutely nothing is killing it. With all these towers, nothing can take it down. Well, in this video, I will show you the only way I've found so far to take down the invisible balloon. And the funny thing is, it's pretty interesting. Once you actually take down, I'm actually gonna get rid of this glue because uh, it's slowing it down too much. But once, once you actually pop this invisible balloon, it will give your tower that popped it an insane amount of pops. I think it's like 9,990 something thousand. It's insane. I have no idea why it's like that. Maybe if someone in the comment section knows why that is, then please tell me, it is very cool. But anyway, the tower that can pop it is this tower, the droid, it, uh, the druid, I can't pronounce it. It's amazing, it can actually pop this balloon. Let's just get rid of all of these towers up here so you can see it more clearly. It's insane, I don't know why it works, but it does work. Um, we'll go on this, we'll get the Thorn Swarm, Heart of Oak, and the Druid of the Jungle. Now, if we send uh, a couple of these balloons now, you'll see that it's, its move destroys it. And if you look at the pop counter now, it's at, is that 59,998,400 pops? That is so many pops. I have no idea how this works, but this tower can pop it. Now, I'm sure, well, I hope um, more of you will find ways to pop this balloon in the comment section. I'm pretty sure this is the first video done on the invisible balloon and how to pop it. Although I haven't searched it up on YouTube yet. I probably should have done that before I started the video. Um, but anyway, hopefully you guys can come up with some more ways to pop it. It is really awesome how it works. Um, of course, I haven't got all the fifth tier upgrades and all the towers unlocked. Um, so that is, uh, so I can't test everything, which is why you guys uh, can test it and see what else can pop it. Um, maybe do a hashtag in the video so everyone can see what pops it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this slightly weird video uh, on Bloons TV 6. I hopefully I can find some more cool things to do videos on on BTD6. I'm really enjoying the game at the moment. So yeah, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe, but click the bell because not not many people are actually getting the notification for my videos. And yeah, hope you enjoyed. See you in the next video.